One 2x2 two two with a triangle airlock costs 4,845 stone to build. 100 2x2s two cost just shy of 500,000 stone. However, having 100 bases also means that there is mathematically only a 1% chance that someone raiding will pick the correct base, and that might just make it worth it. So today, I'm going to be taking on a challenge that might be harder than I think, honestly. I'm going to try and build 100 different bases, 100 2x2s, two because if I build lots of bases, they're less likely to hit the base that has the loot, or I can divide my loot up a lot more. So we're going to try and build 100 2x2s. Two that's a good start. We'll take a compound bow. Dude, imagine if we could get a compound bow play early. That'd be such a good start to the video. Let's actually try and get some arrows. This would have been like a massive base for sure. This is like day three of the wipe. It's crazy that this can like be built up and destroyed so quickly. Oh, dude, that would have been insane. He left my compound bow, dude. Okay, we'll take that. We'll take the small wins. For this challenge to work, I was going to need the perfect location for farming. In total, this was going to cost me roughly 750,000 stone, 250 of which is just for upkeep. I made my way to the edge of the snow because that's generally where you can find the most stone nodes. That's really nice. Okay, what about this area here? Ideally, I want to like look down here and it's just going to be filled with two by twos. Let's do it. Green card though. That's so good. I'm going home with that straight away. There's no hanging around. That is so good, dude. All right, let's go to Sewer Branch. It's kind of far, but we're going to go there anyway. Oh, that's really good. Did that just respawn or did I not loot those boxes? Oh my god, this respawned. What the f... Was that the exact same crate? Was that first one Gears? What? It was literally an identical crate. Oh, dude, it's looted. It must be close to respawning. I'll recycle down here. There's someone here. I got him. Jesus Christ, that was so bad of me. How did I miss that headshot? Well, let's get out of here. I swear I just heard another guy. Yep. This is just a waiting game now, dude. Who can outwait who? I think I go with nail gun. Get shit on loser. I may not have got a blue card from this run, but we were well on our way to a level two workbench. And after doing a bit more road farming, I had all the scrap I needed. Rust Clash is an online gambling website, so this one's for my 18 plus viewers. They have a variety of deposit methods such as CSGO, Dota, and Rust skins, as well as crypto and credit card options. They are the only site that allows for direct PayPal cash out and crypto, and the site gives away over $25,000 a week through their rain feature. Choose from case battles, mines, the upgrader, Plinko, and of course, opening cases. Jump on now to get involved in the $300,000 Christmas Advent Calendar giveaway event. Use code YEXM today and unlock both rakeback and daily cases, which can be claimed 
every 24 hours for free. With the sheer amount of node smacking that I had ahead of me, I knew that it wasn't possible to get all the bases built in a day. However, it was better to get started now rather than later. Let's build some bases, eh? We still need more metal frags for doors, but we can place down the two by twos, I guess, and put one door in each for now or something, maybe. Now, do I use the same skin for every base, the front door? I think I do because then they know that it looks like they're all mine. Okay, base number two. Oh my god, we're going to that. Ooh, not really any cover to this. There's a guy, another guy creeping up. They're going to fight, dude. I think that's a duo countering. If I can just get one of the counters, I'll be happy. Wow, that's so annoying. There's three of them, dude. Dude, I just need to get one straggler and get out of there with a the gun. That's all I want. Okay, they're shooting at me now. I need the guys in the base to kill a couple of them. Ah, oh, dude. So many people rolling up with guns naked. Water pipes, SARS. This guy's dog shit at jumping. <laughs> oh, maybe one day, mate. Yeah, just use the ladder. It's like, oh. Gonna research that. Gonna research the Tommy and the flashlight. going to that. There's two. Yes, dude, we need the saw. We needed that, dude. Starting to come along, dude. Starting to come along. Imagine that. You can't even see one of the bases is down there. Times 10. If you're enjoying, don't forget to subscribe, and if you already are, it really doesn't take too much effort to scroll down a little bit and like the video. While you're down there, why not turn on notifications too so you never miss an upload? Also, there's a part two to this video on my second channel, so make sure to go watch that after as well. With 25 bases complete, it was time to call it a night. But first, I took a quick joyride to get a bird's eye view of it all. Oh my god, dude. That's a quarter of them, dude. 
Am I going to be able to fit them all there? Not raided, baby. Of course we're not going to be raided. How would they know which base to raid? There's 25 to choose from. All right, I'm going to tech tree to Satchel. It's going to be all my scrap to tech tree to Satchel. Let's just go get that one for ourselves. Oh my god, that's perfect. I was, I was literally about to tech tree Satchel and someone's just going to give me one instead. I need him to throw a Satcheling jump up. Perfect. Uh oh. Killed himself, dude. Oh, dude. Do I keep going? What do I do? Keep going? I'm not going to be able to get in, dude. I've only got seven satchels. But I can't get out. <sighs> i got to just hope that this is the last door. Yeah, dude, that's not good. That's not good. What do I do, man? I can't pickaxe out. You think I should let them jump down and hope they have a ladder? He just gave me another bean can. Two bean can grenades and three satchels. It's worth. We're not gonna go. We're not gonna be able to leave here with any satchels. But it will get me to a workbench that I can pick out with. Fuck it, we're doing it. Oh, he actually got me low there. Okay, how much health is it on? 11. What do I use to... Dude, what was that? If they both dropped down at the same time, they would probably have me. He pushes that. No, dude! I might take that home, dude. That's literally what I came here for. Two satchels was everything I wanted, so I researched them and then found somewhere to use them. Oh, these guys are building right here. We gotta get a good look at this base before it gets too big. Okay, so it's gonna be a classic two by one drop down, front door there. Give me a tree. How many are there? They gotta be on timer, dude. They have an armored door, dude. If I can get them on timer, should I raid that sat? Dude, I could raid them. Should I go over with satchels? They're on timer. I won't be able to get through the armored door now. 
Unless I get the door open, I need six more satchels. So maybe I'll wait for them to get the door open again. Right, I'm throwing the satchels right here. I'm going to get them the door open and then go back. Soul and Bonetta. Are you fucking with me, dude? I kind of feel bad, but also at the same time, this is an opportunity. Oh! Thank you for the 900 scrap, man. The door's open, dude. They don't sound like they're in there. Dude, I don't hear them in there and the door's open. I'm doing it. I have no ammo, dude. I have no ammo. That's f dude. Okay, we take that. Two double armored doors. That's really good, dude. I don't know how they had this stuff, but they did, so... With my first raid of the wipe done, I managed to do a pretty smooth cargo run and get a decent haul of loot from it. In particular, a C4, which would come in handy very soon. Then I turned my attention to getting a few more bases down. Damn, he's going up the hill. Casey. Holy shit, Casey. Be careful with that thing. All right, then. Oh, dude, I could not see him, dude. Rosalyn. This is where this comes into play.
Are you kidding me, dude? Casey with a prototype 17? How much can I hit a guy? He's got to be, dude. Casey, dude. Casey's shitting on me. Dude! Oh my god, I hate pink. I want to see where Casey goes. We're finding Casey's base. He's coming straight this way. Please leave him that two by one. We found Casey's base. That's all I needed. Our story with Casey was only just beginning and with his base location, I figured I'd try and get rid of him as soon as possible. There's no way that's him raiding, dude. Dude, do you reckon that's him raiding? If it is, I'm sending it. Raid block, come on, raid block. Bro, I can't believe that. I just doubled him, dude. He sealed it. Hey man, GG's. I was outraged in the field. Uh, dude, I just countered, man. I, I, I don't, I wasn't even the raider, bro. You look, you lucky. Good counter, dude. Close it, close it, close it, close it, close it, close it. I don't know what else I can do, bro. Dude, I... I... Damn, lucky motherfucker. Good shit, though. Honestly, oh, can I get my LMG back? With all day. Oh, fuck no, dude. Oh, fuck no. <laughs> dude, Casey took it over. Casey's inside right now. He won it. Casey won it. Man, Bro, how did I, that I have the doors right here. If you help me up, I'll open them for you. I'm, up, I'm helping him. Dude, oh, dude oh, I, I have the doors right here. Cheesy. He doesn't have doors. I fucking walled it off already. Oh, you won oh, it. Blow. 
Look, 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 you can get in right here. You can get in right here. Go in, go in, go in. Yeah, man. Damn. Okay. Da I tried. <laughs> man, I'm naked. I'm just trying to talk. I'm trying to give you your shit back, people, because you won that for me. Oh. Wait, what happened you, uh, after I die? Good shit. Dude, I was the one raiding you, man. <laughs> he counted me. Oh, you were? Oh, fuck you. Yeah. Wait, what true, happened? True. How you how were, uh, you get back? How you get it back? You uh, you traded Nox, man. You uh, went in there with a SAR and you killed oh. him. Oh! Well, he got knocked. I just then saw... he bled out. He bled out. It was amazing, dude. Good job. Well, there you go. Hey, man. Well, I've had fun PvPing you. I like your raid defense, man. You have like 14 bases. They're all the same. Yep. I was going to build a 2x2 two two right in your bases. But they all look like <laughs> bases. All right. Well, I'll see you around, okay? Here. You want, you want your AK, buddy? Here. Oh, that would be better. Okay. Oh, man, you're too nice. You're too nice. Thank you. I, I promise I won't try to raid you again, okay? <laughs> Have a good day, man. Yeah, man, we can truce it. For sure, for sure. How long do you think you're going to play on server for? How many days? Like, just today or...? Yeah, I don't know. I've oh, just been okay. getting BPs. I actually, uh, I was able to raid into a decayed base up there and I got, like, scrap. Well, there goes the AK anyway. It's him. It's the same dude back. So it turns out Casey wasn't such a bad bloke after all. And it was actually Rosalyn who was turning out to be the issue. There's an AK kid down there. I wonder if that's Casey. That's not Casey. Casey wouldn't be sitting on the rock like that. Oh shit, Casey's getting raided. Time to save the day. We've gone from raiding to Casey to saving Casey. Here we go, baby. Dude, it's Rosalyn. Casey. Casey was gone before I even got to know him. I know I tried raiding him at first, but at this point, it really seemed like there was a bigger enemy at play. Rosalind and Lacey were running amok, and I knew that I had to avenge Casey. The issue with that was that I had no clue where Rosalind's base was. With day two coming to a close, I moved everything to a new 2x2 two two in case I had been watched during the day and then slept comfortably knowing that there was a less than 2% chance that someone would raid the correct base. Waking up on day three, I had two objectives. Finish the bases and find where Rosalind lives. It had been about six hours into day three at this point, and I hadn't seen even the slightest trace of Rosalind or Lacey. Praying that they hadn't hopped off for the wipe, I crafted an AK and headed to the locked crate that had just dropped at airfield to see if they were lurking around it. The locked Chinook crate just dropped at airfield. I've only seen it dropping at train and it dropped at airfield. That's kind of convenient. I don't know how long it's been there, but it's still there, so... There's a guy. 
I can see him. He's right in the bed of the truck there. Silencer. Where is he hiding? Is he in the tower? He is too. He's in that tower. And then the silence gets me. Are you kidding me, dude? I want this guy to win. There's two of them. Don't shoot me. My has he's broken, but I need it for rads. Slugs, I can't miss. This got looted. They ran. Fuck it. Surely he can't get up that cliff right there. He did too. Matilda. Damn, dude, this guy got away with the crate, though. Faulty. I see him. He sees me. He gets the rock. Dude. Unfortunately, none of these names at this fight was who I was looking for. I hadn't seen anything that would suggest that the duo that I was hunting was even still on the server, and I was giving up hope. For something a little bit different, I decided to do a bit more farming for the remaining bases. There's two men farming wood. There's people online in this base. Do you reckon they live here with this guy? Do you reckon they're a trio? I think they might be. I don't really care for this dude. The minicopter. Is he landing on the floor? Dude, I'm getting so tempted with my jackhammer. Well, they pulled up. That's a good angle. 
They know I stashed. They're looking for it. Full M2 boys rolled up. Go on, stand in front so I can get your name, M2 man. Go on, loot that body. Give me your name. Go on, loot that body down the hill. Still one more body to loot. I had almost given up locating Rosalind and Lacey, but a little bit of patience goes a long way in this game. Now that I knew they were online, I just had to find their base, and I knew exactly where to start. I'm pretty sure they had the minicopter, so all we have to do is look for a minicopter and see where they're going to. I know it's within distance of our bases because otherwise he wouldn't have run over there. He was hanging around us yesterday. Wait. Well, that was easier than expected. I had found their armored 2x2 from their minicopter on top, and after Rosalind killed me outside, it was all but confirmed I was in the right place. Before I did the raid though, I wanted to finish the remaining 38 bases that I had to build. It would be a lot, but I was up for the grind. Oh wow, they did check the crate and got the got the jackhammer. Rest in peace, jackhammer, I guess. We've got one jackhammer left. We lose that and it becomes very painful. Oh. Base number 100. That's almost all of them in one shot. Go on. Count them, dude. It's kind of nutty, eh? <laughs> dude, imagine if you got on this server and came across this. What the f*** would you think? 100 bases and a 1% chance of guessing which one has the goods. Now I just needed to type the loose ends and finally avenge Casey. Tonight we party, my friends. Sip on mezcal, I like tequila, damn it, shit tasty. Can you not, I made about a million off a pimpini. 
I feel like my life is a movie, damn, it's too easy. Can't catch me, I'm jumping. Reporters hit the embassy. It's bag or die. Seven gold chains on me, call me slip. Just made an album, seven days, that's cool. Boobies going up and down, she's flipped. Hold up, wait, rewind that shit. Got uncut gems, Adam Sandler. She a vegan, she got a fire there. Get my bill smoke, good, it's my life. It's about the loot. It's about the revenge, dude. The loot's nice, though. The loot is nice. Mission accomplished. Casey would never know it, but I had done what I could to avenge him and make things right. And as for my bases, they had worked flawlessly. Not even the slightest raid attempt had been made, and they lived to see another day. If you want to see what we did with all these bases, head over to my second channel to see me give members of my Discord a base each, and then collectively wall in all the bases together. Thanks for watching.